Okay, so I can guarantee that someone is going to make a video like this and say exactly what I'm about to say. And I am actually going to be tagging Blazekin in this, as you can tell. And also, if you're watching this, well, obviously you can tell. But I doubt you'll be watching this because nothing like that ever happens to me. Oh, hello. But this is about the top dream to the... Oh... This is about the dream story you told us, the the last cut com you made, or as of making this was the last copy game. you did it. This is about the dream story that you told us in the last cut com. Obviously, I'm not sure when this is going up or which cut com it actually would have been or when you uploaded it, but you know what cut com I'm talking about. And you asked us to tell you stories about any weird dreams that we had. So here's mine. Basically, my dream didn't actually happen until after I watched your video and I should probably point out that because I'm in the UK I watched your video quite late at night so it was like I don't go to sleep until like 2 in the morning and I watched it around midnight 1 in the morning ish something like that which is probably why I had this dream that same night so you're not gonna believe this and like I said at the beginning I can guarantee people might actually say stories like this if anyone ever actually does reply or make a video about it but I had a dream from the point of view of the fan that you were talking about. The only difference was, obviously, I wasn't an eight-year-old fan, like you said in your dream. But I was me as that fan. So you know how you said the fan came downstairs and everything? That was just me. Obviously, it wasn't actually me because, you know, it was a dream and I doubt you would have dreamt of me. But plus, I'm not eight. Um, yeah. So obviously, it wasn't exactly the same. But... It, it was a similar dream, so I was like, oh shit. So in my dream, obviously, like I said, it was from, it was me, and it was like kind of in the future. Because in the future, I think me, Pico, possibly Jcat and Ryan were thinking about getting a sort of face house sort of thing, but obviously we're not in phase, so it wouldn't be the phase house. But like a house where we can all just sit and game together and stuff. But in this dream, we actually, we had our house in California and you guys were actually still, or the face house was still in New York. I'm not entirely sure why my brain thought to keep you in New York, even though you, I didn't know you want to move to Cali, but oh, oh well. But we were there anyhow and we decided to go to New York and just come and visit you guys because we th why not? So we came to New York and they were, both of them, they were too scared to go in. So I went in instead and you know what happened after that, you know, the, sh the whole shotgun thing, that was basically exactly the same and stuff like that, but I was kind of crazy. So what I was doing when I was like, you know, killing you guys was pretending to be trick shotting. And you know how the rest went, obviously, because you told it in yours. I ended up, I actually, in my in my view, I actually remember going up the stairs, even though I don't really know what it looks like. Oh, this guy hit a village. That was a little donger. So yeah, I actually walked up your stairs, and Twin and Pico were waiting in the car outside, and yeah, that was that was basically it, to be honest. Like, I can't actually, I, honestly, I don't remember the ending. All I remember was killing you guys, and then going up into Blazekin's room, saw you cowering with Jeff and his puppy, and then it ended for me there, right there. Like, I just saw you guys, like, c crying in the corner, and that, and, and that was it, to be honest. That was, that was, that was weird. I mean, to be honest, it's kind of normal for me to have dreams that involve, like, you know, Call of Duty stuff, because, you know, I'm, I'm a nerd. Wow, this is the best host I've ever played on. So yeah, that is the whole thing. That was my dream. I'm not sure if that's what you were looking for. And again, like I said, I don't really care if any of you believe me because I know other people will probably say the same thing just to get attention. But if not, then but, um, yeah, that's probably the weirdest dream I've had. I know I've had some other weird dreams, but I, I can't really remember them because that was quite a while ago. And I think that that was pretty. That was a pretty weird dream to tell, seeing as it literally involved that video and. Yeah, that, uh... well, I just got four headshots, but it was all faded. Uh, fuck it, I'll do the outro mid-game. Hey guys, so if you enjoyed this video, drop a like and comment if you did. Also, subscribe to Pico and Twin in the description below, as always. And also, follow me in the description below if you have Twitter, because I don't really use it often, but just follow me. Ah, someone recognized me. So yeah, it's your boy in your oh fuck. So yeah, it's been me, um, Expo. Oh, okay, camera uh, has run out of battery. Okay, now I'm blind now. Uh, bye.